Okay, folks, it's been quite some time since I've done a recap face-to-face, -face, but with everything that I have gotten since December, um, I figured this would be the quickest and easiest way to do this. So I've got three stacks of movies here. I've got non-horror Blu-rays and DVDs, horror Blu-rays and DVDs, and then out-of-print uh, movies that I'm keeping and some that are for sale. All right, so let's move along. Ratchet and Clank, Kong Skull Island, Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Ties, the limited 3D edition. Now some of these um, are not on video because I picked them up at yard sales, uh, bundled in with video games and whatnot. And so the footage may have already been shown in a previous live video game hunting episode. Logan. Ready Player One, Sucker Punch, Rampage, Back to the Future Trilogy on Blu-ray, we got Dante's Inferno, the animated epic. This actually um, kind of ties in more of the story that goes along with the video game. And anytime I see this, I, anytime I see anything Beavis and Butthead related, I'm picking it up. Uh, this is Innocence Lost and Chicks and Stuff. A couple of episodes there. And we got Hollow Man. A fantastic movie. Oh, brother, where art thou? And another good Oliver Stone film, which is World Trade Center. This actually sells really well around the time of 9-11 in September, so... Um, that might actually go up for sale around that time. All right, then on to the horror. We'll start with the Blu-rays. We got Psycho. Joyride 3 Roadkill Unrated. I actually have a sealed copy of this. <coughs> Excuse me, if anyone would like that sealed copy, let me know in the comments or shoot me a message on Instagram or Facebook and I will be more than happy to trade with you or just sell it to you for dirt cheap. But uh, yeah, I've got a brand new copy, never been opened. The Vampire's Assistant, Cert de Freak. Possession. Annabelle Creation. Don't Knock Twice. Silence of the Lambs, Misery, Alien 3, and The Lost Boys. On to the horror DVDs. This is not necessarily horror, but it is The Monsters, Scary Little Christmas. And we've got Stephen King's Riding the Bullet. Wrong Turn 6, Last Resort, Unrated. I love these Wrong Turn movies. They're awesome to watch. Quentin Tarantino's Hell Ride. Blair Witch 2. Deep Sea 2, or Deep Blue Sea 2. The Evil Dead. Army of Darkness, Screwhead Edition. Ash vs. Evil Dead, Season 1. Torment. I watched this the other night. This is really weird. The Hills Have Eyes 2, unrated. Two movies I looked for forever. I finally found them at a yard sale. Child's Play and Child's Play 2 in fantastic condition. Actually, the original Child's Play is in a little bit better condition than Child's Play 2, but the discs are both in very, very, very good condition. We got Pet Cemetery 2. This actually has um, Edward Furlong from Terminator in it. And I'm definitely looking forward to seeing Pet, Pet Cemetery of the Theaters. That's coming out this weekend. Macaulay Culkin in The Good Son. He creeped me out in this movie. He did a really good job. And Hellraiser Hellseeker. Alright, on to the out of prints and the movies that are for sale. 
Stephen King's The Stand. This is out of print. Well, that version is. The artisan print version of that is out of print. Um, one that sells for $12 to $14. And people, uh, if you ever come across it for cheap, pick it up. You can make a, a few dollars off of it. And that is Lake Placid. I'm not sure exactly off the top of my head what this goes for. I want to say a good $10. Uh, the Ice Pirates. Also out of print. The next movie has gone down in price a little bit. It's still out of print. And um, you can still on a good day catch 9 to 10 bucks for it. That's Dogma. And let's see what else. Um, I'm not 100% sure that this is out of print. But I want to say it is since it was a limited edition. And that is the limited edition still book of the Chronicles of Riddick. I'm pretty sure that is. One that I am not selling. Uh, this has a lot of old nostalgia for me. Uh, me and my father grew up watching this guy. And we used to cut up laughing. It was a good bonding experience for me and my father. And that is Super Dave. Uh, the Extreme Adventures of Super Dave. And um, he actually died not too long ago. So I, I was ecstatic finding this. Then we've got uh, what is for sale, the uh, 25th anniversary of A League of Their Own, the limited edition gift set, Blu-ray, DVD, plus digital, and there's a few extras in here. Um, there's some cards and all different kinds of stuff uh, included in this. Um, you got the director and cast commentary, 15 deleted scenes, nine memorable innings, documentary, um... Trying to see what all it comes with. Uh, the History of Women's Baseball Booklet, Vinyl Stickers, Cards, a Patch, and a Luggage Tag. So, if you're interested in this, let me know. And it is brand new. Uh, what is also for sale is the Sabata Trilogy. And this can fetch about 12 to 14 15 bucks. And um, I picked that up with a few other movies to flip so that I could put the ones I wanted in my collection for free and the best find out of all the out of prints is the Mac I've seen copies sell for 40 to 50 bucks I've seen them sell for 25 to 30 bucks I currently have mine listed for $24.99 it's in fantastic condition and uh, if anyone is interested let me know but there you have it folks that's everything I've picked up since the end of December I hope you have enjoyed the content. If you have, go ahead and leave that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and hit that bell icon so you receive all notifications when I upload new content. All right, folks, I hope you are having a fantastic week. I'm Tata Collector, and have a good one.